Now we are looking at how Kaiser Chiefs could line up for next season, the 2021-2022 season. We are just taking a look of how Kevin Hunt could set up his team next season. Should all the players that are linked with the team come through? You know, so many players have been linked to move to Naturena, but we, we just need to see that if really all these players come through, then what's going to happen? We are aware, of course, that Itumele Nkune is going out, and more other players such as Willard Katsan and all of that. But let us just look at the lineup that we could have for Kaiser Chiefs for next season. In the post, Daniel Akpei. Because Itumele Nkune is really rumored to be on his way out, Daniel Akpei will of course become the automatic number one choice. But unless Kaiser Chiefs decide to sign another keeper, we know that Darren Kidd is a free agent. In the back four, of course, you will have Ramakram Patele, who could be the permanent captain should Itumele Nkune leave. Then you will have Sifiso Sandi, whom we are aware that is definitely joining Chiefs after having trained with them for a few weeks earlier in the season. Buhle Mkwanazi, Buhle Buyeza Mkwanazi who was once linked with many teams, Pirates, all those teams, but Bukhle seems to be wanting to choose Chiefs. And Bukhle Mkwenaz is one of Gavin's hand favorite players. And of course, it seems like Njabulongo Obo has chosen Kaiser Chiefs over Mami Lodi Sandals and Orlando Pirates. We won't mention Eric Matoho in the last four because it is said that he's looking to have an offer overseas just to go and finish off his career there. That is the back four. Let's recap. Ramachem Patele, Sifiso Sandi, Muse Buyaza Mkwanazi, Njabulo Ngobo. Those are all new players. Hmm. In the midfield. Nkosingi Pile, Mshini Ngobo, Benak Paka, whom is a favorite player of Gavin Hunt. Patuchezo Nange, a mystery, that one. A player who did not celebrate against Kaiser Chiefs in the 2-2 draw. He scored the second goal for Stellenbosch FC, but decided not to celebrate. Patuchezo Nange. And of course, Jabulo Bluom. Now, with without Katsande set to leave, Nange will become the perfect fit for Central Midfield Road, partnering with Bluom. You know, while Parker and Ngobo take the wins. And of course, the front two, it is known that Rose Khamaldin has signed for Kaiser Chiefs. And of course, we know who will partner with him. Samir Kukotapiano Nukovic. Khamaldin is a top solo scorer with about 11 strikes in the league from 20 games. Nukovic will, need, Nukovic will need someone who will put a little bit of pressure on him so that he can do more little because he's quite capable. That is how Kaiser Chiefs could line up next season. That is the Kaiser Chiefs that you might be having the next season. Now, in other news, we are aware that Sipombule has agreed terms with Mamilodi Sundown. So Kaiser Chiefs has lost on Sipombule. But also we are understanding that people say, Zuma must not go. Zuma must not go. Zuma must not go. Dumisani Zuma, having came back after months of being out, coming in as a substitute in the 60th minute, went on to help Kaiser Chiefs to win, to get themselves to get into the quarterfinals of the KF Champions League. Dumi Zuma Msholozi was found, created a penalty, and also assisted Kamapila to score the goal that took Kaiser Chief to the quarterfinals of the KF Champions League. Msholozi. Let's watch the space. A lot is coming.
Kaiser Chiefs. 